Good morning everyone. Hope you're all doing well out there. Marie and I, she's up there, are doing very well. After about 10 days in Wyag, we decided we need a change of view. And uh, it was getting a little hot there to be honest. No breeze in Wyag, there's too many mountains around. So we moved over to a place called Sayang, which is not very far away. It was an easy little half day cruise and um, Wow, what a beautiful place it is. I mean, look at the colors behind me. You can see Shahalian out there. And behind her is a boat called Ilya. They're friends of ours, Chris and Vivian. They built their boat in New Zealand and had two kids on her. And, uh, and they're a real cool couple. And I got to know them last year and I've spent a bit of time with them. And so yeah, it was good to um, have some contact with other humans. As you'll notice if you've watched my past videos, a, a big part of what I enjoy making videos about are people that I meet along the way. Um, normally local people on small islands or, or whatever it might be. But um, you know, during this period now of COVID and all this unrest in the world, we don't actually get to meet people anymore because everyone's suspicious and afraid and no one's allowed to really deal with each other and so it's sort of a big part of the, the cruising aspect that's been taken away momentarily. I hope it's going to return soon. The video is about villages and people I meet along the way. We'll have to wait a little while. Um, just unfortunate how it is. I miss it greatly and I uh, miss showing you guys at home these different cultures and mentalities and the way people live in that on these small places. But I'm sure it'll return to some sort of normality soon. In the meantime, we'll just try and show you some of the beautiful places we're going. sad like we get used to see all this plastic like and it's really like not a lot here like we are pretty happy when we find a bit like this Here we can see the tracks of the turtles. I think there are three nests of eggs of turtles here. There's a turtle nest that's been raided by lizards, I think. Here you can see a bunch of eggshells and things around. There's a little fishing camp. Pretty good spot. They obviously just come come through here and do fishing or harvesting turtle eggs maybe and um, coconuts probably as well and stay for a few weeks, set up camp and then uh, move on. There's a few of these around the island. I think you, I looked through the binoculars yesterday when we arrived and you could sort of see a few of them along the edge of the island. Sort of nomadic families I guess that do the rounds. Pretty cool life. Not so much in this house. Not really, no. 
Ah, there's a lizard. And you. I'll try the well, see if the water's any good. Yeah. How the water is? Gonna try. Well, it's nice and cold. It's fresh. Fresh water? Good. Yeah, I think yeah, fishermen in Asia normally say something. 
Yeah, maybe better to get going now to get in the deep water, otherwise you get shitty waves and so Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna start packing up. We gotta put the dinghy stuff away, but I'll need like half an hour or so, but I'm uh, maybe gonna try and leave after that. Okay, alright, yeah. We'll probably get ready to, to get going here. Yeah. Okay, cool. See ya. So what happened was, about 10 o'clock last night, we were over at Ilya having some dinner and beers and uh, the wind started picking up from the southeast, which unfortunately in, in Sayang where we were, that's the only open uh, part, you know, it was sheltered from the, the north, the west and the south, but um, so it started pulling through and it kept blowing all night and so it was getting a bit choppy in there. And, woke up this morning and um, just the, the whole sky was black so we decided to leave just because we didn't want to get stuck in there if it would just get worse and worse sooner or later the waves get so big you can't get out the channel in amongst the bombies but now it sort of looks more sunny and better we've got you know it's 16 18 knots and we're just cruising back to Wyag Ilya's in front of us um, just a bit of a safety call to leave but we'll go back there and film a little bit more we um, left before we could film everything we wanted and, and do everything we wanted but our yeah, safety first we don't want to get caught in a trap sort of Well, we're nearly back to Wayag, as you can see. Two reefs in the main, and uh, the jibs reefed quite a lot. We're on 30 degrees to the wind, so we're sort of on the limit, but uh, I think we'll just get in. The wind's slowly shifting around, but yeah, good to have a strong wind sail again. First time this season. Had a bit of trouble putting the reefs in because I hadn't done it before and uh, made a few mistakes, but yeah. Uh, Good to see Shahalian still ripping along. Yeah. 